Is it the right time to buy or sell the Boyle ETF? Welcome back. Today, we're delving deeper into the Boyle ETF. We previously shared an overview on our website on Tuesday, November 21, 2023, and now we're here to bring you a more comprehensive analysis. To stay up to date on our latest insights, be sure to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell. You wouldn't want to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Take your trading decisions to the next level with our cutting-edge AI stock analysis tool, powered by GPT-4, available at stockinvest.us. Unlock the power of artificial intelligence and receive free price predictions and in-depth analysis for any of the 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please remember that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. As of November 6, 2023, our system has identified Boyle as a potential sell candidate, with a score of minus 3.38. Now, let's dive into the stock's performance during this period. The stock has experienced a significant loss of minus 30.57%. This means that on average, it has been losing minus 2.55% per day since it was flagged as a sell candidate. The ETF has broken a significant downward trend and is currently falling. While there may be some temporary reversals, a further decline is expected. Any rebounds back to the breaking point of $48.84 should be seen as an opportunity to exit. It's important to note that the fan theory suggests a potential new bottom line of $27.60 for the next trend, but this is still uncertain at this point. Looking at the three-month trend, there is a potential minus 4.88% change expected over the next three months, with a possible return between 12.41% and 61.32%. In terms of the 12-month trend, it indicates a minus 51.30% change over the next year, with a potential return between minus 100% and 391.29%. This means the price could range from $0 to $203.05 after a year. Our latest update for Boyle brings some concerning news, Tuesday was a red day for Boyle. On Tuesday, November 21, 2023, the price of the Boyle ETF dropped by 3.68%, going from $42.91 to $41.33. This marks the fourth consecutive day of decline. Throughout the day, the ETF experienced a 5.76% fluctuation, reaching a low of $41.23 and a high of $43.60. Over the past 10 days, the price has fallen in 8 instances, resulting in a total decline of 27.47%. Interestingly, the decrease in trading volume on the last day aligns with the decline in the ETF, which can be seen as a positive sign. Specifically, trading volume decreased by 80,000 shares, with a total of 5 million shares being bought and sold at a value of approximately $224.64 million. Looking at the past 52 weeks, the highest price recorded for the ETF was $1,189, while the lowest price was $41.23. Currently, the price is 96.52% below the 52-week high, amounting to $1,147.67 and 98.53% below the all-time high, which was reached on June 8, 2022, with a price of $2,810.01. In this video, we'll discuss the signals indicating the current status of Boyle. Currently, there are few to no technical positive signals for the Boyle ETF. Both short and long-term moving averages suggest a negative forecast for the stock. Additionally, the relation between these signals shows a general sell signal, with the long-term average above the short-term average. On corrections upwards, the stock may face resistance at the price levels of $47.83 and $59.95. However, if the stock manages to break above these levels, it may issue by signals. A sell signal was issued from a pivot top point on Tuesday, October 31, 2023, resulting in a decline of minus 39.98% so far. Further decline is indicated until a new bottom pivot is found. Additionally, the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD, currently signals a sell. It's worth noting that the volume fell alongside the price during the last trading day, reducing the overall risk as volume tends to follow price movements. Here are some other signals that you might find interesting. 
The moving average convergence divergence is indicating a cell signal. The pivots are showing a cell signal 16 days ago. Bollinger bands gave a buy signal 34 days ago. The short-term moving average is indicating a sell signal 13 days ago. The long-term moving average is indicating a sell signal 13 days ago. The relation between the short and long moving averages suggested a buy signal 10 days ago. Now, let's take a look at the 12-month chart. The short moving average is indicating a sell signal 13 days ago. The long-term moving average is indicating a sell signal 13 days ago. The relation between the short and long moving averages suggested a buy signal 9 days ago. If you want to find more signals, be sure to visit our page at stockinvest.us. Let's talk about support, risk, and stop loss for Boyle. Currently, there is no significant support from accumulated volume below today's level, which means that the ETF may not have a strong foundation to rely on. This could potentially result in a poor performance in the next few days. Boyle is known for its high volatility, meaning that it can experience significant price fluctuations throughout the day. In fact, the Bollinger Band indicates a wide prediction interval for this ETF, classifying it as very high risk. Looking at its recent performance, Boyle had a price range of $2.37 between its highest and lowest points in the last 24 hours, which accounts for a 5.76% change. On average, over the past week, the ETF has been experiencing a daily volatility of 7.76%. Today, let's analyze some key day trading levels for Boyle. In the case of an upward trend, the initial resistance level for Boyle stands at $45.43. If you don't currently own any shares, it might be wise to wait until this level is surpassed before entering a new position. However, if you're already holding the stock, this level could be a potential consideration for swing trading. It's important to note that there's no significant support from accumulated volume below, which means that under certain circumstances, the stock could experience a sharp decline. It's crucial to exercise caution and consider taking positions only if you're an experienced trader who knows how to navigate such situations. After careful evaluation, we have determined that this ETF does not meet our criteria for investment. Furthermore, it is important to note that no stop loss has been set for this particular ETF. Is Boyle ETF a good buy? Currently, Boyle is showing several negative signals and is in a wide and falling trend, indicating weak performance in the upcoming days or weeks. Thus, we have a negative evaluation of this ETF. Upon analyzing the volatility and movements of the last trading day, our system suggests that the current price of Boyle is undervalued. For Wednesday, November 22nd, we anticipate Boyle to open up at $42.05, with an initial trading price of $42.05, representing a gain of $0.722. Before we begin, it's important to understand that trading comes with a high risk of losing money. We strongly recommend speaking with a financial advisor before making any buying or selling decisions. Please note that StockInvest.us should not be the sole basis for your investment choices. By using the information provided, you agree to take full responsibility for your investment decisions. Welcome to Stock Invest. Today, we're taking a closer look at the stock market. We're interested to hear your thoughts, so please comment below and share your opinions. What are your target goals for the ETF? Remember to like and subscribe to stay updated with our latest content. Wishing you successful trading and a beautiful day from all of us here at Stock Invest.